Hello everyone. In today's walk, you'll be tagging along with me as we explore Denman Street in Vancouver's West End on a beautiful fall day in October 2021. We'll start the walk at Robson Street and work our way south to English Bay. Here we are at Robson Street, the first uh, intersection we'll see. Robson is uh, Vancouver's main shopping street in downtown. Um, here we are heading south on Denman. Uh, Denman is one of the main north-south streets in the west end of Vancouver. Um, further west uh, is some residential and then you pretty quick uh, run into Stanley Park. Um, the west end is a very popular neighborhood in downtown Vancouver. It's very trendy, um, full of uh, mostly medium and high-rise apartments and condos. And the odd century home is still left, but they've often been divided uh, into apartments or are uh, being used by businesses. Um, Denman is uh, is a nice uh, little shopping street full of mom pa shops, as well as a lot of uh, cool um, restaurants and coffee shops and that sort of thing. Here we are coming up to Harrow Street. Now, West End Vancouver shouldn't be confused with Vancouver West, which is actually a completely separate city on the uh, north side of the Burrard Inlet. On the opposite side of the street, we're coming up to an old movie theater called the Bay Theater. It was constructed in 1938 and uh, was a movie theater right up until 1989 when it was converted into um, retail. The Bay Theater is actually the only building on Denman that is uh, historically listed. You can see one of Vancouver's famous trolley buses driving by. Vancouver has one of the largest uh, remaining uh, trolley bus networks. Here we are at Barclay Street. As you can probably tell, there's a lot of uh, cool little markets and uh, small little uh, one-off stores on Denman as opposed to the chains that you find on Robson Street. Denman forms the uh, the westernmost street of a of a box made up of um, four popular uh, shopping streets: uh, Robson to the north, uh, Denman to the west, Davie to the south, and Granville to the east. They sort of form uh, a box uh, encompassing uh, the West End and part of downtown Vancouver.
That was Nelson Street that we just crossed there. West End Vancouver is one of the most expensive neighborhoods in the city, as you can probably imagine. Rents here are, are pretty crazy. <laughs> um, although you still can find a deal in, in some of the older buildings. Here we are at uh, Comox Street. It's looking towards the east down Comox into the more uh, residential core of the West End. Those four streets that I mentioned earlier are sort of, they're not on the border of uh, the West End, but they're just sort of on the outer edges of the West End. So primarily uh, uh, the main uh, residential areas encompassed in between those, uh, those streets. But as we look towards the West, you can uh, see some additional residential before we hit Stanley Park. This neighborhood was originally built up in the late 1800s uh, to the 1920s. Originally, it consisted mostly of, uh, of single-family homes, but now there's very few of those left, and it's mostly, uh, mostly mid-century, uh, mid-rise towers and, high, and newer uh, high-rise condo towers. You also do find some older... Uh, three or four story walk up apartment buildings as well mixed in. So it's quite a quite an interesting neighborhood with a wide mix of uh, of housing styles. Although as I mentioned before, those remaining uh, century homes are all now businesses or have been subdivided into apartments themselves. This is Pendrell Street that we're crossing now. There's a look to the east. You can see some of those apartment buildings. And now a look to the west. Some more apartment buildings. There's some patios that have taken over the uh, the uh, sidewalk, which is kind of cool. You can see some of Vancouver's famous palm trees <laughs> and another trolley bus. Coming out to Davies Street, which marks the southern end of that uh, four retail street box. 
That's also uh, the intersection with uh, Beach, uh, which runs, not surprisingly, along the beach. There's a look down Davies Street. There's a look at Vancouver's famous laughing man uh, art uh, installation. Which, if any anybody else finds it creepy like I do, let me know in the comments. <laughs> Maybe I'm just self-conscious. I think they're laughing at me. Here's Beach Avenue. And here we are approaching uh, English Bay and English Bay Beach. Just hugely popular anytime the sun is out. Actually, even when the sun isn't out, it's still popular. There's a look there to the west. Out across the water is Bowen Island and the Sunshine Coast. And then looking there uh, more to the south is the University of British Columbia. And uh, turning towards uh, West Point Grey and Kitsilano, which are other neighborhoods of uh, Vancouver. The inlet that you can see is actually the uh, beginning of False Creek in Vancouver. And uh, we're going to end today's video here at the Sundial. Thank you for joining me on this walk down Denman Street. If you like uh, urban walking videos, mostly of Vancouver, but other Canadian cities as well, hit subscribe and uh, hit the notification button to be notified when I release new videos. And if you really like this content, feel free to support me on Patreon.